What's going on everybody? Hope you're all staying healthy and having a great day. So in this video, I want to show you guys how to schedule your Hive OS. So for example, let's say you're managing somebody's rig and your agreement is for them to mine to your wallet for two hours every day at a set time. I'm going to show you how to do that. So let's get into my Hive OS. All right, so as you can see, we're at the Hive OS main page of my farm. First things first, obviously you need to set your flight sheets. So I have went ahead and created a ETH flight sheet and I have created an ETC flight sheet just for examples for this video. So what we'll do is we'll have it mined to this wallet mainly and then we will have it changed to this for like two hours out of the day. So now let's go to settings. We're gonna go down here to where it says add tag. We're just gonna name this switch so i'll save that now we have a tag called switch so now let's go back to our workers i'm going to click on my 1660 super amped rig all right so we're here in the 1660 super amped rig now we're going to go to settings and we're going to go down here to to select or start to type we're going to click on the tag we just created which we named switch and we're going to click update worker all right, once we updated the worker, we're going to go back to the overview. As you can see, the tag is right here next to the 1660 Super Amped Rig. So let's go back to the overview of the farm. We are now going to go to Schedules. And we're going to go to Add Event. All right, now once we're in Add Event, let's go to Tags. Choose the Switch tag again. All right, so now we're gonna come down to flight sheet and we're going to choose which one we want. So let's say that I'm already on ETH right here. So what we're gonna do is choose the ETC so it switches to ETC flight sheet during this scheduled event. So we're gonna skip everything else because the overclock template isn't gonna change unless you're changing coins like ETC to Ravencoin. Uh, as you guys know, Ethereum, and Ethereum Classic is more a memory dependent versus a core dependent. Ravencoin is more core dependent. So if you're going to do something like that, then yes, you probably use an overclocking template of some sort. But that's for another video. We're going to come down here and you're going to choose a time. All right. So say I choose Tuesday the 25th, which is today. And I want 9 a.m. I want it to turn on 9 a.m. On Tuesday the 25th that's gonna be the first day it's gonna go over to this flight sheet the farm time zone we can just leave it at the farms time zone we want it to repeat daily once you choose daily it's gonna drop down with this so we want it to be every one day at and we'll put nine o'clock right here it says end repeat and it's on never that's because we want it to always continue on this setting we're going to name this etc mining and we're going to create so as you can see the 25th of may 2021 at 9 a.m this rig switch which is the 1660 super amped rig is going to switch over to this etc hive on flight sheet so now we want it to go back to eth once two hours is up so we're going to go back to add event. We're going to choose a tag. We're going to choose the same exact tag switch. We're going to go to flight sheet. We're going to go back down to the F Exodus wallet. That is the flight sheet we had this rig running on prior to this whole thing switching. We're going to skip this stuff right here because we don't need it. The overclocks aren't going to change. The start date is going to be the same just ahead two hours. So it's going to be 11 o'clock on the 25th of May the farms time zone we're going to choose daily at a time again every one day it's going to repeat at 11 o'clock and repeat never because we want it to continuously do this we're gonna type in ETH mining and I'm gonna save the schedule all right as you can see every day at 9 a.m. this rig is gonna mine ETC for two hours until 11 a.m. that same day it's going to switch back to ETH 
So this is perfect for somebody that is managing rigs and wants to take hash power as payment. I could literally put a schedule like this on somebody's rig that I was managing and get paid out in hash power for two hours every day with no hiccups. Of course, unless the internet goes down. Let's go back, we'll check out the rig. As you can see, the little icon next to the switch tag is the icon of the schedule being set to this rig. So, hopefully you guys all learned something today. Please don't forget to hit that like and subscribe. Also, we do have a free Discord group called Misfit Mining where we'd love to have you. Please stay safe, and we'll see you guys next time.